we have like a ton of tricks up our sleeve and all kinds of stuff that you know kind of um gets a lot of attention you know on the internet and uh but we can't just take all of those features and kind of throw it at every client you know what i mean you got to kind of figure out which ones fit what client I, i've had i have ideas that i've had for a decade waiting for the right client to to do that with when i first came here it was already done so i'm like okay we're gonna tear something out that's already finished it's important to me like the focal points because a lot of times especially in southern california indoor outdoor living is a big deal so you want to draw people's eye out to the end of the focal point this is called a place of fire it's a take on a fireplace just kidding We like to have them low and sleek and long. All of the vertical facets glow. And I do that because I want it to look like it's floating there. The pool doesn't have a deep end. We designed it all, you know, under four feet, three to four feet deep. So you can hang out in the entire pool. You can sit there with your cigar and your whiskey or your beer or whatever, not, not get wet, you know what I mean? Or the kids can go in there and hang out. It, it like you talk to the client you have an interview period with the client sometimes they're really outspoken and they're like i love this that you did here and i want this and i saw that you know and they're like all over our instagram other clients are a little more shy they're uncertain and it's our job to sort of interview them and kind of pick their brain and see what they're into So the way onboarding works is uh, we have a landing page where the client comes in, fills out all their information, and this gives me like lots of uh, stuff to chew on to get to know the client. Some people like um, mid-century modern, like that's really popular these days. I mean, it's been popular for a while now. Some people like uh, just really cold, modern, very sleek and, and sharp looking, you know, almost like really cold, you know, and then some people like a mix. Some people like you know, modern farmhouse mixed with ultra modern, you know what I mean? So it's, and you can do stuff like that, but you, it's, you gotta be real careful about how you meld those styles together to make it not look like, you know, I, I like cinnamon, throw cinnamon in there. Oh, you know what I also like? I like, uh, you know, I like hot sauce, throw that in there. Like you wouldn't, you know what I mean? So you gotta sort of try to do the fusion in a way that it, it really makes sense. And if you can do that, that's what impresses people.